Hey guys, HDV here and welcome to a brand new video. Today we're going to be taking a look at all of the new riddles and potential leaks by Riddler Koo. He posted a bunch lately. We're going to go through a massive breakdown of all of them. So if you're excited for the video, make sure to drop a like down below. Let's try and hit 500 likes. It really helps out. Leave a comment with your thoughts on anything we cover in today's video. Subscribe if you're brand new for daily Pokemon content. Ring the notification bell. With all of that out of the way though, let's get into the video and I really hope that you enjoy. So, starting things off, it has been a busy weekend for Riddler Q. He did post a bunch of new uh, tweets and stuff, leaks for Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet, kind of confirming that this month is going to be about regional variants and regional forms and stuff, and that Tauros basically is going to get one. Um, but anyway, this was the first one that he posted, where it just says two question mark, three question mark, four question mark, five question mark, and then 30, A5, 73, 3C, E2, and 9A. Honestly, no idea. I don't even know where you begin with this um, at all. Uh, obviously, we originally thought like the two um, and then the... Uh, well, we thought like it was like a one, two, and a five for like the regional forms of um, the like the cow and the bull Pokemon like Miltank, Tauros, and Bufflin. Now there's a two, three, four, and a five that have popped up. I don't know what these coordinates mean, bloody A5. I think he's playing battleships or something, but I don't know what's going on there. But that's the first one that he posted. Uh, the next one that he posted is this one saying, theme for this month is regional forms. Uh, could you figure out these two new regional forms? So he says there's two new regional forms. So not only uh, is it more than one now, but he's also confirming that Pokemon Scarlet and Violet will in fact have regional forms. Now, of course, we were going to kind of guess we were going to get regional forms anyway, because I think it just makes game freaks life easier because they can bring new pokemon into the game but they don't really have to think about it too much they just have a pokemon they already have and then just change its type and its design a little bit and then boom you got a new regional form and it counts as a new pokemon whereas before they had to just come up with new pokemon straight off like out of, of, of nothing so um yeah regional forms are probably going to be in the, all of all the pokemon games now but the fact that we're getting two new regional forms um as well i mean i'm sure it's gonna be a lot more than two but two are like probably going to be like the first ones that he kind of talks about and stuff um the next tweet was this one saying i'm still considering how to arrange teasers about brand new pokemon because i'm going to take too much of a risk if i can't deal with them properly gen 9 has got too many creative and cool designs so maybe you need to wait for a while so this is an interesting phrase here he says gen 9 got too many um, so that could be talking about like the Pokedex size, you know, there's too many Pokemon in this game. It is a brand new game, open world, you know, never had an open world Pokemon game before. So I think they really going to go above and beyond with this game. The graphics already look incredible. The animations, the, the, the models and stuff for the Pokemon look incredible. Like you can see the scales on Surviper and like the shininess of the metal on Magnum and stuff that we saw in the reveal trailer. So they're really going all of like above and beyond with this game um but they're also saying too many creative and cool designs so that's getting me really excited to see what the kind of pokemon we're going to be taking a look at in pokemon scarlet and violet's going to be um soul silver i actually uh tweeted this saying definitely take your time and play it safe it's always nice to see official reveals too if the pokemon company ever do them also i don't uh, know about everyone else but i don't expect you to tease every single new pokemon we appreciate whatever you want to do um so yeah again i mean people still think that like riddler Koo is like fake and everything like that and doesn't know anything he did actually just recently post like um the final eight people in the masters um in, in the pokemon journeys anime and like the master division or whatever um i'm not gonna show them or anything because i don't want to spoil it um but then the actual like anime leads came out and revealed that those characters were indeed the last eight so he posted that before that happened so not only does he know stuff about pokemon scarlet and violet he also knows stuff about like the pokemon anime so this guy is like 100 legit um so you kind of have to believe what he what he says when he comes out with it he's never got anything wrong uh whereas like other insiders and stuff have got stuff wrong in the past so anyway went on a bit of a tangent there the next thing that he tweeted out saying uh what well, he was quite retweeted theme for this month is regional forms could you figure out these two regional forms and he says a theme of march is gimmick um, while for April being the mascot, but if they repeated Pokemon Legends Arceus box cover design, don't blame me, you know what mascot means. So, yeah, this is an interesting uh, tweet here. So, he did say that there's going to be like a theme for each month. So, March's theme was obviously the gimmick of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, while for April's was the mascot. Um, but of course, the Pokemon Legends Arceus box cover didn't have a mascot on it was just kind of the two protagonists with starters and pikachu and starly and shinx i think and then obviously just taking a look into hisui um so it could be a similar box kind of art to that which obviously won't have the mascot but he did say that april's 
theme is about the mascots. So all those Pokemon Masters stuff is all about like the mascots. So potentially like the legendaries and stuff and, and everything like that. The next thing is this one says to make it clear, these two teasers are two new regional forms. So this is a new regional form here. So this is what we think is like the Tauros regional form with the one, two and the five talking about the bulls and the cows and stuff. Um, so the fact that he's put like two more bulls there as well, I don't know if that was on the first one. So it could be like three new regional forms or whatever. We don't really know, but it seemingly is going to be Tauros. And then this is also another hint to a regional form. So um, this isn't anything to do with like the Tauros or anything like that or the Miltank or Buffalon. This is a brand new different regional form entirely. He says to make it clear, these two teasers are two new regional forms. That's all for this month. Several different teasers and themes prepared for next month will be chosen and adjusted accordingly on whether a new trailer is out in May and the concrete contents revealed by the Pokemon company. So he says that, you know, there's going to be a lot of teasers and stuff for next month if we get a trailer in May. So potentially could get a trailer in May. Again, a lot of people are expecting one, but he says that's all the teasers for this month. So this month, we're going to just kind of be like cracking down on what these two regional forms are going to be. And there's going to be loads of speculation about it and stuff. Um, but yeah, there are two, at least two new regional forms. Also confirms that there are going to be regional forms in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. So very, very interesting hints, tweets that he has posted about. Um, and again, I always say take it with a grain of salt, but this guy's track record is so good that, you know, you don't usually have to take it with a grain of salt. Now, you kind of just believe him. I mean, I believe him. He's, he's he's given us no reason to not believe him. You know, he got everything right about Pokemon Legends Arceus, everything right about Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl, got stuff right about the anime, um, and yet now he's saying things about Scarlet and Violet. Uh, we have a couple of, like, breakdowns to go over as well for this. Uh, so, this is the first tweet by Soul Silver Art saying, Spoilers, really juicy information. Confirms that March was the gimmick we've just been assuming. And then game cases could potentially look like Pokemon Legends Arceus's. So no mascot legends on the box. Sorry for always saying box legends, Twitter character limit. I hope the Pokemon Company uh, Inc. still reveal them soon. Lastly, many cool and creative mons. He says, I should clarify, the game cases may look like Pokemon Legends Arceus. Q said, if. Also, if it's really similar to Pokemon Legends Arceus, that doesn't mean the mascot legends won't be on the box art in the group. Disclaimer about my tweets, I try to never deal in absolutes. Most everything I say is possible scenario. Um, so they've kind of been doing this a lot recently right now. As you can see, this tweet here by Delta saying, so boys and girls, look out to see a legend flies away, maybe. Um, so this this was like Legends Arceus, and then this was uh, the I choose... Was this the I choose you? Mean? No, this... Was it? I don't even remember, to be fair. Um, and then this was... Um, no, this was the I Choose You movie. And this was the Zarud movie, I think. Um, not the Zarud movie, the one before. There's so many mythicals now, you know what I mean? But yeah, so they're kind of going in this direction now where they're kind of just looking off into the distance and then there's like a legendary or something in the distance and stuff. So that seems to be something that is popping up. Didn't he say it'd be revealed in March and April around the same time for the next announcement? This really got me thinking that May is the month we finally get news. Either a Pokemon Presents or a trailer. He only saved that April, but still... Uh, and he said, no, Ku is saying if they do the same as Pokemon Legends Arceus, he doesn't know how they'll look, um, which is obviously what that tweet is in response to. And then the last thing we're going to be going over is this as well. So this is about the other regional form, not the bull. It says, now you know what I did. This month's theme is regional form. So I think Soul Silver already knew that, um, but obviously didn't want to say anything. So Tauros and Ratoncito, we just have to figure out who Raton, Raton is. Raton? I imagine those numbers tell us, but I have no clue where to start. Help. Also, I didn't think about this before, but this means that Bull Picture isn't about a Bull evolution, just a regional form. So... Uh, yeah, this one apparently isn't a. Uh, I don't even know where it is. I've lost it. This one. This wasn't isn't a regional form. It is an evol uh, isn't an evolution. It is a regional form. So it's either a regional form of Taurus, Miltank, or Bufflon. And then this could be. I don't even know. Some like different regional forms. We don't really know. And this is just kind of speculation and stuff. Like I say, this will be linked in the description down below if you want to take a look at any of these. But yeah, they are all kind of the, the just the, the leaks, the riddles and stuff um, to kind of go over for today's video. Again, there'll be loads of speculation and stuff coming out over the next few days. So we'll cover all that and everything. This is just kind of the start. We're planting the seed with this and... Um, seeing if people come up with anything about it but yeah they are all the new league breakdowns and everything for pokemon scarlet and pokemon violet all of may's um hints rumors riddles whatever you want to call them again could still be seeing news this month and if we do see news this month then we're going to get a lot more teasers by ku um next month so yeah hopefully a lot of stuff to look forward to this month but again we'll have to wait and see that's going to be everything from me though i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to drop a like down below let's try and hit 500 likes Leave a comment with your thoughts on any of these riddles. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Subscribe if you're brand new. It's everything from me. Have a fantastic rest of your day. And until next time, peace.